Ethan John, get your stupid video link out of the way. Because that dreamy stud just said hi to me. It used to be fun when I wouldn't post a picture in the past because it gave me a lot of mystique, a lot of mysticism. But now, <laughs> there's not much to hide. Nobody's asking about me anymore. Ethan, get your stupid video link out of the way. That dreamy hunk just said he loves me. Ethan John, get your stupid video link out of the way because the comment before that was this dreamy hunk saying he loves me. I'm still pretty. <laughs> Ethan! Ethan, you didn't have to act like a fucking butthurt troll just because I leapfrogged over your little video link because that hot stud of a muffin said hello to me. Aww. It was really exciting, unlike your video. And then you go rage quitty again. He was just excited because he saw my devil horn halo photo, which you have saved to your hard drive. And he got a big old boner. I have that power. But I don't need you fucking trolling me, okay? Cunt. <laughs> It's Haven, still to know, juices. Don't you hate it when you see a bunch of people park in the handicapped spot, but they don't have a sticker, and then when they get out of the car, none of them are limping, no one has a walker. What the fuck? Also, at my job, we have a lock on the bathroom door. So that makes people think it's a fucking community center. So people like to use our bathroom to take a shit. Just because we have a lock on the bathroom door doesn't mean it's a free shit house. When people see the word free, they get a little carried away. It's not a community center. This isn't the YMCA. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> and what's up with people parking diagonally? Why the fuck do people park like this now? See this car, how it's parked diagonal? What is that? Now look over here. There's another car parked diagonal. Why are people parking their cars fucking diagonal now? They don't know each other. They're not together. I see this all the time. It's some kind of fucking new trend or something. Why are you parking fucking diagonal? Also, why can't people get dressed when they go out in public? All these guys wearing slippers with socks and these basic bitches wearing pajama pants and those little fucking moccasins. What happened to the days when people would fucking wear a hat and tie? You cunt. Also, I saw a lady in the store the other day with a fucking dog. And when I asked about it, she said it was her emotional support animal. What? what? Get the fuck out of here. Emotional support animal? You get to bring a, can I bring a kangaroo or an elephant into Caldor? Grow the fuck up. We live in the pussy generation. Fucking <sighs> grow up. Oh, moist. Also, no, I guess that's it. <laughs> Wanted the edgy Discord kids. Possibly demonic. Last seen at Zelly server. If seen, do not engage. Very dangerous to trigger the chatters. <laughs> If you see the edgy Discord kids, please report them to Sherlock Holmes. Beware. Everybody. I recently had to remove some people, girls, from my server for causing too much drama with the men. For whatever reason. Penis envy. If you guys are gonna have flame wars, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to throw you overboard. Just when you feel triggered, take a break. Step away from the keyboard. Go take a walk. Go read a book on mental illness. Or just like chill out for a little while. Masturbate. I don't know. Smoke some doobage. But try to keep the rivalry to the absolute minimum, meaning zero. Because I don't play that shit. Okay? Thanks. Now those of you that I've removed, I'm sure you understand. Oh, that's really upsetting. Oh, poor Zelly. <laughs> I really liked her. We would talk about makeup and stuff. I was hoping we would become great friends. She kicked me from her server, yes. Oh, she had kicked me from her server. She she must have done it by accident. Obviously, her deleting all of the girls was a mistake. Clearly, she meant to delete all of the men. I understand. And I wish her well. Oh, sorry, she's dead. <laughs> Bye forever. Excuse the makeup. I was at a costume party. After all, it is almost Halloween. I found out what's been going on regarding Zelly's death. And now I'm going to tell everyone. <laughs> It's raining on your shots, but not mine. I knew that the purge would give me a lot of enemies. So before they could retaliate, I pretended to be killed. I pretended that I was already taken care of so that they'd leave me the fuck alone. But then Stormy found out, so I had to ice his ass. Bye forever. Fuck off, Ivy.